Hello people, welcome back to the channel. So, last weekend was my birthday, as you guys could see in the videos that I posted last weekend. And I did a lot of you guys, so I posted two streams for you guys, I did a Japan vlog for you guys, and then obviously a lot of stuff for my family, I bought them dinner and all the nice things. But I didn't buy myself some presents, so that's the reason why we're doing this video. We are we going we are going to be opening a lot of Pokemon different Pokemon packs because I wanted to do something for my birthday and since it's a late celebration for myself we are going to go all out but before we do that I have a little package here I don't know if you can see it it got it's a package I obviously I know what it is but uh, for the people that don't care don't care about holo life and stuff like that you can just skip to the time step that I put below in the comments so you don't have to see this you can just go straight into the Pokemon opening but for the people that are interested here it is let's see what we have here oh god so so I wasn't planning on putting oh god there goes my camera um, I wasn't planning on putting this in the video, but I don't, you know what, I might as well, since it is still a present that I bought for myself, uh, in December, I believe. So, yeah, I'll just, I'm just here showing you guys. There's, like, a lot of tape. They used a lot of tape for this one, so I don't know, I don't know why. Uh, I do understand why, but still, there was a lot of tape. Okay, there we go. There is a box inside of the box, so this box is empty. For you viewers, here it is empty. We just throw it away, and then we go to this smaller box, which the real present is inside, obviously. So, what do you guys think it is? First thing first, I already gave a hint, I believe. Yeah, it's from Holo Life, so let me know what you think in the comments, right? Here it is. If you haven't left the comment yet, uh, do it now. Because I'm going to reveal it. Oh, I didn't reveal it. Here's another empty box. It's empty again. There we go. So, first thing first, we got an arc light stand of one of the favorite girl, my favorite girl, Pricora. Here it is. We got an arc light stand, which I am usually not that big of a fan of, but recently I have started to buy some and I do like them because they doesn't take too much space and it's just sitting there and it's good for decoration. So, there's the Arclight stand, and then obviously we have a, I don't know what's called in English, but it's a, what, what do you call it? You just put your glasses on top of it, so it doesn't, uh, you know, affect your table or stuff like that. I forgot the name. Oh god, but uh, here it is, this art that I got is from Glass maybe stone some stone sort or something that is the material and then the main thing that I wanted it for was the glass here it is here's the glass it's a super cute Usada Pekora glass with a lot of flowers and then we got the uh, rabbit icon on the middle so you obviously if you are going to drink some wine because it's a glass a glass wine uh, that's what I believe that is used for then you just put some wine on it and then if you don't want to drink you name it take a break you put it on top of your <sighs> that thing <laughs> and then you can just go and watch your arc light stand so that was a little bit of holo life let's just go to the Pokemon opening I think most people want to the, see the Pokemon cards so here we go alrighty alrighty here's the Pokemon segment are you ready? So, first thing first, what do we have here? We have three pack battle styles starting starting easy. We have battle styles, the new set that I haven't opened yet on this channel. That means we are finally going to be opening it. Three packs. Maybe we can get the Chero or the Karina full art. That's the main reason why I love this set. But I love Shining Fates. And that's the reason why I'm doing one of the tins that you saw in one of the previous videos. That I got three of the tins. One tin contains five Shining Fate packs, which means I can save the other two for another video. And it's totally fine for me to be opening one of the tins. And since Eldegross is the favorite of the three, from the Boltant and from this fella, I thought I would definitely be opening Eldegross since it's, it's technically a birthday present for myself. And I will be opening the most favorite one of myself, right? So, second of all, here's the main reason why I'm doing this video. I haven't done a Japanese opening in a long, 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 long while. So here it is. We got Rapid Strike. 
the Japanese edition, which uh, rap strike and then there's a single strike combined to, into English battle styles. So yeah, for sale in Japan only for opening elsewhere. Let's just start with opening the packs. And yeah, so throughout the video, I'll be opening in between uh, some battle styles and some shining fates. So people don't know when exactly I'll be opening one of these. So the viewers just don't skip to their uh, respective part and then go to oh I want this code and then you take the code and then oh you're gone you're not watching the video right that is not what he wanted so we got the plastic off here it is oh god there goes my camera sorry not camera microphone let's just open this one let's just start with the first pack of rapid strike if I can open I can't open it here it is rapid strike 30 packs I believe, look at this bad boy, let's just stick them out of the box, so we have these 30 packs right here, we throw the box away, and then we just shovel this so there is not like any uh, trick that I did, or any like oh the first pack gotta be a V card or something like that, a pat pattern, that is what I'm trying to say, so 30 packs, uh, light blue, which is one of my uh, what, which is my favorite color. We got the Rapid Strike Urshifu on the front. I think he's a pretty, pretty good designed legendary in my opinion. Here is the Japanese packs that I have opened in a while. So, oh, they are so small. That's the reason why there's 30 in a booster box because there's only five cards inside of it. We go one to the front. I still believe it's one to the front, and we turn it around. What we have here, so it's the Japanese set, which means I don't know like 80% of the names. Sorry for that. I do know this fella's name, he's Hitmore. We got an Odex, we got a Per Ugly. Hey, let's go. We're starting good. We got a Victini V card. Victini is one of the favorite mystical, mythical Pokemon, so I like Victini, which is pretty cool. We got a Victini V card on our first pack. Is that something? Is that like a foreshadow for this box that I get the. Cheryl full art. Oh yeah, by the way, for the reason why I chose this set is because there is the Cheryl and the Korea, uh, Korea full art in this uh, Rapid Strike box. They are both in this set. That's the reason why I chose this box, obviously, right? That's the only main reason. And I also chose Rapid Strike in the Sword and Shoot expansion. So, oh, nothing. Ultra Ball. Got an Ultra Ball on this pack. Second pack was nothing at all. I remember how hard these yeah these are supposed to be a cut with a scissor that's the reason why the pack art the pack on top of it is so thick or long i mean long but uh yeah so yeah i did have i do have a scissor next to me but i can't be us we are here let's go to this third pack here it is fiction bell we got snake we got a uh, bell sprout per ugly and we got some kind of fan nice so the reason why I also like the Japanese boxes is because there's guaranteed one amazing pool. So that means one pool that is above the set number, a secret rare in English. On to the front, here is a Cubones Evolution Marowak. We got a Ponyard Evolution, whatever, Bellsprout Evolution. There is a border there, which means it's a reverse, uh, holographic I mean, it's a holographic. Steelix, here is Steelix, look at this bad boy. Next pack, I've got the holographics has a border here instead of inside the actual card art, a uh, pack art. Yes, so that's something different from the Japanese one. We got this fella, I forgot your name, obviously I'm bad with names, so you can't help, I can't help. We got this Carva, Carvina, no, hmm. Onyx. We got uh, Beetle, whatever your name is, sorry for the butchering name again. <laughs> That's the reason why English has one benefit, I can read it off the cards. Japanese one, mm, not so well, my uh, Japanese is not that advanced to be able to do that. Here is, uh, what's your name? So, he's in Pokemon Go, he's the research encounter <laughs> at the end of this month. We got some kind of gadget. We might soon start to crack open the Battle Stealths and the Shining Fates because we are you know, I mean, I think seven packs in. I believe seven packs or something. Here's Karina. I want her in full art. That's the reason why we're opening this box. Or in battle styles. I don't care in which set, English or Japanese. I'll take them both. We got this book. There is, I believe, a V card on the end. Heat more. Oh, wait! 
Oh no, it's just the Vmax. Oh, I thought. Mm? Is this the Ultra Pool from this box? I don't know. We got Rapid Strike Urshifu Vmax. That is something. That was a mouthful. But uh, yeah, here it is. Look at the art. It's I love the Vmax art. Look at the, the different color patterns on the background. And then we got this big fighting fella on front of it. Holy crap. Nice. That's one pool. I don't hope that that is the ultra pool. Which means it's kind of sucked. As if that's the only pool. Then. Yikes. So we put it in a perfect fit sleeve. And then in a normal sleeve. This sleeve is the Femax Venusaur. Which I opened but I didn't post. Because the pool was jack crap. It was really crap, so that's the reason why I didn't post it. Here is another look in a sleeve. Good pull, but I don't hope that is the ultra pull from this box. I hope there is like what? Oh god! I hope there's like one more pull, one more amazing pull. Here it is. One to the front. Cheryl, the the main reason actually, because Karina is the second reason. This is the main reason why we want to open this box. Cheryl, I want a full art. Okay, please. Pokemon gods, Arceus, if you're listening to me. Okay, okay, you know what? It's fine, it's fine. We have a lot of packs left. We are going to opening we are going to open the battle styles and let's just get a crack at the English version. Maybe the English version is where there's at, right? And obviously there's shining fate on the back, so I hope to god that I get a shiny card again. Cause the shiny pools are not that great in my opinion. So we just put a we got put or Urshifu, which I pulled. I think it's the same, no it's not the same art, but it's the same concept with different art. I believe that's also the Vmax of Rapid Strike or Ur Urshifu. Here is the code card. Oh god, we have code cards in the English edition. Here is the code card for the guys and boys at home. Guys and boys, that's basically the same thing other than age. Oops. Electric type energy. So, something different. The packs are also thicker. More cards. Hone Hedge, Electabuzz, Beltoy. I can actually read the names. English Slash and on the end, Concluder. Not any good. Let's just go back to the Japanese one. Maybe there's more luck there. I'm just ripping through these packs. I might damage the card on the inside, which isn't a good thing if I put Cheryl or Corrida. Here is uh, Luxray Luxio. Luxio. We got Fire Snake, we got Eclamio, we got. What's that? Oh, Fish. And we got Tapu, Boo Boo, Boo Boo, Boo Boo. I think your name is Boo Boo. Next pack. So, this might be a long video, because, you know, I'll be opening. One Japanese box is usually long enough, but then I am adding a lot of packs to it, so. That's good. I love it. More pack arts for me to look at. Here is Cedra's Evolution. Nay, this, this is Cedra. What? 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 What's this gadget? Another gadget. A lot of weird gadgets that I have no idea what their purpose is. Why are they putting gadgets inside of a Pokemon card? I'm not going to use gadgets in the Pokemon fights, right? Or maybe other than the XP XP share, which is an amazing gadget. If you can call it a gadget. Uh, Beltoy. We got Minfu or something. There is something on the back. Okay. Uh... Insect. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> this fella. Concludor? No, not, not, not Concludor. That's the fighting type. Uh, Cricketot? Cricketot, maybe? Maybe Cricketot? He looked like Cricketot, right? I hope it's Cricketot. Otherwise, my bad. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I know a lot of Pokemon fans are cringing right now because I can't pronounce the names or I can't even remember them in the first place. Let alone pronunciation. Here's one to the font. What do we have here? We got an insect. We got another insect, but fire type. We got Beltoy. We got Ponyard. And on the end, Concludor. Here, this is the real Concludor. This fella. Let's go to Shining Fates. I want to see some shiny cards. Let's go. And with plastic. I love the box art, by the way, from Shining Fates. We go to throw the plastic on the ground. And then let's take a look. We have Beltoid. We got Beltoid. We got. Uh, bird, and then we got Elder Cross on front. Let's just take the uh, take this out. We'll take a look at the promo card in a second, because that is guaranteed a shiny card at least, right? That's the reason why we're opening shiny fates. We just pulled out the first pack. Here it is. We got a toxicity shiny card. Let's just see if we can get a shiny card, please. Full art shiny, full art shiny. That's what we want. I haven't pulled this full art shiny yet. 
other than the promo cards, which I don't count because I haven't really pulled them because I got them for free basically. Well, not really free, I pray for them, but I got them guaranteed, is what I'm trying to say. Here's Psychic Type Energy Monkey Ball Guy. If you got this guy full art, I'm so sorry, man. I'm looking at you. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Tropius, Yanma, we got a Morpeko, Cosafleur, Coughing. And then my camera died, so you have to believe me on this one because I, I really didn't do anything. My camera really died, so I had to restart the camera because my camera, uh, you know, restart in every 16 minutes, I believe. Here's a Q fan on the end, in the D, so there's no reason for me to fake it in the D, right? Here's in the D. Holographic, so at least we got something from the Shining Fates pack. Let's go back to the Japanese one, please, for the love of God. I am hoping there's one more Ultra Pool. I swear to God, if this, if that Urshifu was the only one, then I am going to be triggered. I am really going to be triggered. Unless I get a full art shiny from uh, Shining Fates. Conclador. Insect. We got... Kingdra. Kingdra. Holographic. Plus another pool. Which is cool, because... Holy shit, there's still a lot. I thought we were halfway already, but I don't think we're halfway. <laughs> Let's keep going. But uh, yeah, so guaranteed, uh, so box is guaranteed some holographics, we got some V cards guaranteed. And then obviously the one ultra pool, which is not in this pack. Here is fire snake. Fire centipede. I, I think it's more like a centipede than a snake, right? Yeah. My English vocal battery is not coming out today. Sorry guys. Here's a lot of energy. I don't know what they're doing. Are they like fusing or something into a bigger energy? We've got Odex. Uh, Cheru, Cherby, or something. We got this buffalo, so or something, and then we got insect lady. Next, after this, we are doing one more. Uh, let's do shining fates, right? There's five packs of shining fates, I believe, in a tin, which is a lot because usually a tin comes with four, and this is five. Uh, f lady fighting, <laughs> fighting lady, f lady fighting. My English vocal bear is really not coming out today. Heat more. We got Conclador. And we got the normal Rapid Strike Urshifu. We can find it evolve our VMAX Urshifu with this card. Which is pretty cool. Here it is. Look at this bad boy. Look at this fighting bad boy. Oh, you are sick, right? I pr he's probably got a lot of girls. He's a real alpha, right? I believe he's a real alpha. What did you guys choose, by the way? Did you would you rather have the Rapid Strike Urshifu or the Single Strike Urshifu? Let me know. I'm really curious about this one because uh, I've seen a lot of debate which one is better. Like, oh, One Punch, like One Punch Man, and finishing everything off, or or wearing the enemy down with multiple punches and then you get the better stamina to keep punching, punching, punching until your opponent is worn out and you win. Uh, let's just take a look at the pair cards I forgot. Here's the four different... That's really co <laughs> coincidentally, didn't it? It's the Femex Charizard, Rainbow Rare, uh, Shiny cards, whatever. Charizard, Charizard, Charizard. Let's go with Toxicity, which is like my least favorite. Let's remove this box and put it aside. Toxicity, the least favorite, I believe. Maybe Corvic Knight. I believe they are on the same tier. If I had to rank them... Here is the code card for you guys at home. Please, shiny for art. Shiny for art, shiny for art, shiny for art. Here it is. Leaf type, leaf energy. There, so I read something somewhere that this set uh, missed out the Marnie full art, which a lot of people doesn't like. But they are probably doing it in a promo box or something. So I will definitely try to buy that one because I love that Marnie card. There's no full art in this one. And there's also only a Luxury Holographic. But uh, yeah, I really want that Marnie Full Art card. Obviously. Because in Shiny Star V, the Japanese one, that was the most expensive card from the box. Even more expensive than the Shiny Charizard, I believe. I believe she's like playable and Marnie it. <coughs> This is the ultra pool. Uh, I saw a four trainer, so maybe it's one of the two. And then there's this guy. <laughs> I totally forgot your name, but I don't want you. Oh god, we got this guy full art. You know what? I'll take it. At least it's a trainer full art. It could have been worse, I believe. There's like some rainbow red 
full art, uh, Pokemon that I didn't like, so... <laughs> I'm actually sad. I'm actually really sad. But you know what? We'll take it. We'll take it. At least it's a full art trainer. I like full art trainers. I love to look at the art. So that's something, right? That's something at least. Oh, I'm really not. It is probably only the only pool. Because it's a Japanese box. There's no more pool than that. You know what? It's fine. Maybe I'll do another box. Maybe I'll do another box in the future. But I have to buy it. So here it is. I put it in double sleeve. I'm not going to put you in a top loader. Because I am not that big of a fan of you. Here is the card. Uh, yeah. Enjoy the look card. The, enjoy your art. At least we see something. At least there is something. <sighs> Let's just hope Battle Styles got the channel right. Let's go straight to, to Battle Styles. Please. Tyranitar. Give me hope. Maybe give the alternate art of Titar. I believe that is also a very cool art. That a lot of people like. I don't know the actually the real value of the battle stealth card. Yeah, I haven't really looked into it. Here is the code card. If my camera wants to focus. Hello camera, you okay? No. There it is. Code card. Four to the front. Here we go. Darkness type energy. More Peko. Darkness type. Dough blades. Cheryl, full art. Is that a hint? Please be in this pack. Glygarn. Slamnit, Bronzor, Kegnia, Spoink, uh, Towers of Water, uh, Ente Holographic. Oh well, let's not speak about that pack anymore. <laughs> let's just go. You know what? At this point, I'm just hoping Shiny Face gave me something because I believe the Japanese packs are not giving me anything anymore. Or you have to be extremely lucky to get a box which is too ultra rare, which is very, very unlikely. Like that pack just now. So let's do a let's do a mega pack, yeah. So what we do is we take one for the to the front. This should be the ultra rare or the rare card. We put it on top of the glass here and we keep the camera rolling. So you guys uh, don't don't think that this is fake. This idea is stolen by Max Movo, which I love. He's a great YouTuber. He is one to the front. And then the rare card is on top of that. And then we go to the bulk first. You know what? We do three. Let's do three. Because the pack are so small. Only five cards in the pack. So it should be fine, right? Let's go one to the front. Here's the rare card. We put it on top of there. And then we go to the bulk. Maybe I messed someone, something up. Or maybe not. Shinx, Bellsprout. We got Mr. Mime, Bellsprout, Cubo, we got Claydol, we got a Corefish Evolution, and then Cubo and Indidi. Let's take a look at the three rare cards. First thing first! Oh, we got a Corefoot Knight V. Corefoot Knight V uh, is something, at least a V card, right? But I think it's one of the guaranteed hits. And we got Cherubi. Cherubi, I think your name is. Cherubi. Uh, holographic. And on the end, we got nothing. That was three packs. Quick, right? How many packs do we have left? We have like seven packs left. Let's do one more and then we go to the Shining Fates. And then I believe we will also finish with Shining Fates. Since that's my last hope of on a good pool. Here it is. What do we have here? Double energy. Double fighting type energy. Uh, yeah. Here is the Octillery. Octillery. Holographic. I said I was going to do Shining Fates, but I totally forgot. This video is long enough. Let's go one to the front. Let's just try it. Oh, I don't want to talk about him. Bunyard. We got this. We got this. And then we got Galeria, Mr. Rhyme. Shining Fates. My last hope. Three packs. Shiny Charizard? Maybe? Nice. What do you think? Shiny Charizard or not? Do you believe? I think I saw a border there. <laughs> I think I saw a border there. No cap. Four to the front. Please, be a shiny full art. Darkest type energy. Here we go. We got a Rust's Shield. Elder Gross. We got a Cramorant. His name is Cramorant! Apparently his name is Cramorant. Here we go. Now we know his name. Rowlet. Trap Inch. Snum. Crookie. Spinnerack. Yeah. Yes! This video is saved by this guy! Yeah! On the end. I don't care about the last card. We got a shiny full art. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first ever Shining VMAX Full Arts of this channel! 
Here it is. Look at this guy. We got a Sand Scrooge Phoenix Ward. Let's go. You know what? I don't care about this video anymore. I don't care about the Ward Trader. We got a Shady V Max Full Arts, which I wanted. It's not the best one, obviously, because, you know, Charizard is in his head. Um, Drippy. Oh no, Drippy is a promo card, I believe. So he's not in the set. I believe you can't even pull him. Here it is. Look at this fella. Perfect fit sleeve. Let's try to find. Holy shit, there, my table is a mess. I don't. I will show you after this one. But uh, yeah, let's take a Venusaur sleeve. Let's put you inside the Venusaur sleeve. And then the top loader will come later. Here is the fort. There we go, boys. We got one. So, let me show you the mess. Like, look at this mess. Holy crap. <clears throat> Let's not talk about it. So, let's just start trying to wrap this up. We will also take a look at the, the promo card of Full Max uh, Femax Autogross. I don't think it's Femax. Maybe it's a Femax. I don't know. Cubone. Okay, Luxray. Holographic. Another check. I believe, like, maybe we will get one more V card or something, and then that's it for the Japanese parks. Opening these are probably useless. I could have just sold them for a little bit higher price with a little bit of profit instead of wasting them. But I am not a hoarder or a seller on eBay or whatever that they are called. So, yeah. Let's take a look. And then after this one, we will take a look at the promo card. And then we do Battle Styles. Cheryl. Unfortunately, we didn't pull you. I'm so sad right now. Oh. Here is this snake, cobra, whatever you are. Let's just take a look at the promo card. They are better protected these days. Because I remember back in the days when I started to come back and open the Pokemon packs again. I believe they are not <laughs> that protected that well. Here is Autogross. It's not VMAX. It's a normal V card. But at least it's a uh, shiny card. Full art. So I'll take it. It's a guaranteed pool. I'll show you the promo card later in this video because I believe you get this card, this card right here in the online TCG. Perfect fit sleeve. Here we go. And then the Venusaur, Venusaur, my man. You know what? I'll take it. We got two shiny cards and potentially maybe one more in the last two packs. Let's just finish these three, which are probably just junk. Probably just junk. Yeah. Why did I say that twice? No idea. I just ran out of commentary because I am not that happy about this box at the very least. That is like an understatement. Not happy is really an understatement. Here's the last two packs. Let's go through them. Maybe we get one more uh, holographic. You know what? I don't want to do much. Holographic. One holographic. Ooh, Cleto. Bellsprout Evolution, Ponyas Evolution, Brockfish, Brockfish, and. Don't know. Don't know. Don't ask me. Do not ask me. Here's the last pack of the Rapid Strike box. We couldn't pull you either. We got Shinx. We got Insect. Horsey. <coughs> and we are editing with the Femax Corvic Knight. You know what? I'll take it. We got a Femax Corvic Knight, which means it's not the worst box that I have opened on this channel from the Japanese uh, edition. Here it is. A Corvic Knight Femax. I'll take that. I'll take that. So, yeah. Here it is. Let's go to the last Battle Styles. Oh, there's a coin here. I forgot. Battle Styles had a coin and a promo card. Here's the code card. And here is the Eevee code card, which is bent a little bit. That's the reason why I don't like the three packs, because the promo cards are usually bent. Because they come in a box with a lot of these three packs. And then, yeah. Here is Empoleon. I believe it's Empoleon. Yes, Empoleon. I have a lot of junk. A lot of trash here. We go. Here's the code card for you guys at home. We go four to the front. Let's do an upside down pack. Leaf energy. We got Cheryl. Please, Cheryl, be in the set. I believe she's also in the set, so I don't wouldn't mind that. Parichisio is that name. Here is the reverse. Nothing. Battle styles. Disappointing. Just forget that. Just trash it. We don't. We don't talk about it anymore. Two Shining Fates, right? Two Shining Fates. This is where it's at. Here's the code card. You can just scan this out across. We go to the Dreepy. Yeah, so I believe the Dreepy is, comes with a product which I have. I believe I have the Dreepy box, which I will be opening in the future. I don't know when. Don't ask me when, because I never know. I will never know. 
for to the front. Let's just wrap this up. Here is the Steel Type Energy, Ball Guy, Dardix, Elder Gross, Horsey, Yanma, Morpeko, Coughing. Oh, oh! Frostbow Shiny! Here it is! We got another Shiny! Let's go! Let's go! Shiny Fates! You know what? The Shiny Tin, Shiny Face Tin was way, way better than the Rapid Strike Box and the other Battle Styles 3 packs combined. That is a fact. Only end. I don't care about you. First of all, shiny card. Two shiny cards and shiny fates. That's a dub. That's a W. Right, all right. Here's the last shiny fates pack. I don't care anymore. We got two shiny cards from the tin. It was an amazing tin. I don't care what anyone says. This opening was worth it because of the two tins and obviously the Picora stuff there. Here is the last shiny fates pack. Let's just go straight into it. We go slowly, yeah, yeah, let's go slowly. Here's the goat cards. Four to the front. I'm dragging this video out. I don't know why. It's long enough already. I believe it's like a 30 minute video, maybe. Maybe less if I try to cut a lot of stuff. But here is the water type energy. We got a Flotzel. Rusted Swords. Luxio. Slum. Crookey. Spinarak. We got a Shinx. Shady. Oh no, it's not here. It's a horsey. Shiny. No. Roll it. Okay. No more shiny cards. Oh, no! Yeah! Hey, you know what? I'll take it. We got a more Quebeco Phoebe card to end this off. Thank you guys so much for watching the shit show. <laughs> it was a really shit show. Emotion Laura Coaster. I don't know what to say yet. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you're new here. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.